Hi there, this is Deanna Nichols, doTERRA Blue Diamond, and I'm going to talk to you about presenting doTERRA. And as I was getting ready to talk to you for a few minutes, I was thinking, what is my secret magical sauce about presenting? And I know that when I have my most successful events, whether they're one-to-ones or classes or whatever I have, people always tell me when I've had a lot of enrollments with the, the, the comment that I hear the most is, wow, you are so passionate about the oils and that really comes through. And so I some days I don't feel as passionate as others because of just other things that might be going on. And so if I want to connect to that passion, I literally use passion oil. And how I like to use it is I like to take a little and just put it on the outer part of my ear and just kind of rub it in that area. And of course I inhale it too. And it just helps me to kind of get in touch with that part of me who really is passionate on a normal day when things aren't crazy with kids and home and whatever. And so um, that is how I stay connected to my passion. I want that to shine through every single time that I present doTERRA. So what I'm gonna talk to you about for a few minutes is a new way that I've been presenting doTERRA the last few months. And um, I think there's definitely, um, there's definitely some huge benefits to doing it this way. Now, I will say that always, always, always the most effective way to present doTERRA is face-to-face -face, in person where they can touch, feel, smell, taste the oils. Um, sometimes though, that's not an option. And so what we do is we use Facebook Live to present a lot. And how I began doing that was I have a public Facebook business page and I invited my team to attend um, a Sunday night live event that is only 30 minutes long. And what I basically do is I talk about the basic oils that are in some of the more basic kits. Like maybe I've done the Aroma Touch Diffused, I've done the Home Essentials, I've done the Family Wellness, um, I've even done the Aroma Touch kit. Um, and so I think I said that twice. <laughs> Clearly it's the end of the day. Um, but at any rate, I will just talk about the basic oils and then I give an enrollment opportunity at the end. And what I encouraged my team to do was invite people that maybe they've been sharing the oils with that haven't yet come to an in-person event, or maybe if they were, um, kind of new and they had not yet ever taught a class or done a one-to-one -one on their own, I invited them to bring their guests there. And I told them, you know, it's going to work best if they've tried some samples first so they have an experience with the oils. Because usually at a class, I'm putting oils on everybody and I'm letting them taste them, lick them, smell them, eat them in their snacks. And since they can't do that on Facebook Live, I am... Um, trying to make sure I get samples in their hands beforehand. So um, that's how we started doing it. And then I started to realize that I could take it even farther and I could do private Facebook live events. And so what I'm doing is I'm creating an event on Facebook and I'm making somebody the host. So I have a girl who I enrolled in Fort Lauderdale and I live in Tennessee. So what I did was I encouraged her after she got right after she got her kit to just invite some friends over to her house where her oils were. And then I created a Facebook, a private Facebook event where she could invite her friends just so they knew the date and time to show up at her house. But then I went live from the event. So only the people that were basically only her is the only person I needed to see it. Um, so she could show it to her friends in her living room while she passed her oils around. And then we had those people come back the next week and bring their oils back so we could open them up and figure out what they do. And we told them that they could bring a friend. And just by doing the Facebook Live events, we have gotten her to just almost elite. And I have never set foot in, in Fort Lauderdale. Um, I've been just doing that long distance. And I also have opened it up um, some events to people who have um, a lot of different people that live in different areas. So I have a lot of missionaries on my team and they're located in one area, but their family and friends are like all over the place. And so they can't really have them over to their living room to play with their oils and to try the oils. And so what we do is we set up an event like on Facebook, like a week or so before the actual Facebook live event happens. And um, we do little giveaways and for the prizes, we're giving away samples. And so I'm mailing those out and getting them in their hands and I'm, I'm trying to share top 10 oils or oils that I'm gonna be sharing during their Facebook Live event and so that they have some of those in their hands and they've actually tried the oils. Um, and so that's kind of how we've been getting around the experiential part for those that don't have a group of people in one location. So you have people on your team that, um, are introverts, you have people on your team, and it might be you, <laughs> who um, 
maybe you're new to an area or maybe they're in the military and for all different types of reasons, they can't necessarily do in-person events or they're trying to build a distance team and they can't travel there. And it's not um, financially uh, reasonable for them to travel there because the team's not big enough yet. Maybe there's one or two people. And then what I discovered part three is that I could do multiple events in multiple homes in multiple cities at the same time. So if I'm trying to grow a group in Fort Lauderdale and I'm trying to grow a group in Maine and I'm trying to grow a group in California, I can have the event and I can make three different hosts and three different living rooms and I can be one teacher and I can be actually teaching three classes simultaneously. It is genius. It has saved me a lot of time away from my family, a lot of expenses uh, for travel, and it is a great way to get a team up and going. The other thing is, is if you keep it super, super simple, then everybody's going to feel like they can do it. And so I'm not teaching anything crazy. I'm just kind of um, going over the oils. I play with the oils. I talk about what the basic oils do. I show them some type of a reference book and I read like a recipe out of there. Um, I, on my Sunday night event, I did um, oils for kids and I made a little um, sleep tight recipe and I did that right in front of them so they could see it. And then I gave this away. So I did a drawing for everybody who is there live. I said, I have them say, you know, I'm a guest of so and so and they tag the person that invited them in case there's multiple hosts. And um, then I do a random drawing and then they win that. Okay, so it's really simple to do. You guys can so do this and you can literally build executives and elites just by Facebook Live. Um, so I would love to hear from you on some other creative ideas that you have about how to present um, besides just the regular in-person stuff that we've done. Show us some of your creative ideas and post those below so that other people can learn from your ideas. Thank you for the opportunity to share this with you. Have a wonderful day and shine on.